Huh? Kale, you ready? Wait, hold on. What? Kale. <laughs> All right, well, yeah, while I wait patiently for a keel, I want you guys to uh -huh. check this out. Clatter in the corner as the rain falls once again, and there's right in by Kuhlmann. And Toronto FC have the goal that gives them a 3-2 lead. Welcome into a very special episode of the All Access Show. Thanks for joining us, Akio. My apologies. Sorry, I got caught up with my phone there. But yes, this is the All Access Show, the space where we talk Marlies, TFC, Leafs, Raptors, and of course, all the cool stuff going on, like that concert at the ACC coming up, Jay-Z and Kanye. Are you going? We're going to dance to one song and one song only. <laughs> Can I always count on you. Yep, of course, I'll be there. You know I will be, man. Jay-Z's my guy. I was at the last concert. I know you were too. Absolutely, yeah. But now we're at BMO Field to talk Toronto FC. And of course, to Tor talk Toronto FC, we are bringing our special correspondent, Asif Hussein from TorontoFC.ca. Our insider. Our insider now. CONCACAF Champions League. What's going on? I hear there's some decisions being made about the venue. That's right. Uh, the choice right now is between BMO Field right here behind us or the Rogers Center over at uh, the middle of the city. Now the game's on March 7th? It is on March 7th. That is the first leg that Toronto will host right here. And the March 14th leg will be back in Los Angeles. And uh, March 7th, it's, it's uh, pretty chilly in Toronto. <laughs> Uh, understatement. <laughs> yes, uh, it can be pretty chilly. Sometimes you can get lucky though, but do we want to take that chance? There's a lot of contentious issues about either venue, and all of that you can read about at torontofc.ca. Awesome. Now, see if you were in my hometown this week, Burlington, now I'm not going to take offense that I wasn't invited this time. You're but, a Toronto uh... girl now. You're a Toronto girl now. <laughs> Let us know what you were doing there. Okay, we were in Burlington yesterday with head coach Aaron Vinter uh, for Damien Molloy, a season seat holder for Toronto FC, who actually won a Toronto FC branded Kia Sportage because he renewed his season tickets. By the early bird deadline. He was one of three finalists. He won it right here at BMO Field in the last game of the season. And we actually surprised him. He didn't know that head coach Aaron Vinter would be there, but the coach popped out of the back seat and surprised him with keys to his brand new car. Now that's, that's an experience. Awesome. Okay, so Asif, um, thank you for your TFC update. And uh, I guess. I'll, I'll go wait in the van. Sure. Okay. Yeah. That's cool. All right, we'll see you in a little bit. Okay. Moving on, uh, Kat, let me catch up with you. What have you been up to this yeah, week? Yeah, well, this week, uh, well, it's Movember. Yes, it is. And it was Movember Awareness Night at the game this week. And I snapped this pic of this duo uh, just outside Gate 1 before the game, like father, like son. And also, Melissa Colby's wife tweeted a picture of Cruz rocking a stash <laughs> as well. So make sure you follow your Maple Leafs on Twitter while they're on the road. They're still tweeting about team dinners and, and such. So, uh, yeah, check join it out. In. Of course. And Saturday night, please join the hashtag TML Talk. That's our live Twitter chat. Join John Sinden and Matt Ivo as they discuss all things going on in the game. And uh, that's it for the All Access show, I think, today, right? Yeah. What Where, the? Where's what are you... the van? <laughs> what? Where's the van? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Yeah, just just give us two minutes, okay. Asif. Thanks, Asif. Um, I guess on that note, uh, we're going to close the show, but since he made another appearance, let's give you some more Asif. Let's check out another one of Asif's cool videos from torontosc.ca promoting the CONCACAF Champions League. Once again. 